Welcome, everyone. This is Justin Chug with Ensable, and today we're going to be talking about Office 365 integration sales. The reason why this is so powerful is because in any sales appointment strategy, we need to come up with the product that will open the most doors. That's the whole reason why we're talking about Office 365 today, not because we're going to make a lot of money selling it or even any money at all, but we will indirectly because it opens doors and creates conversations. And one of the best ways to start conversations about Office 365 is by discussing integrations. There's thousands of integrations, products, vendors, and services that work with Office 365. Millions of companies that are using the platform. And so understanding how to leverage these integrations and how they work with our own product set will essentially help us create conversations. And so what we're trying to accomplish here is trying to optimize manual processes internally, how to optimize sales, how to optimize appointments for our, our prospects by helping them leverage Office 365 integrations and how that directly or indirectly works with our product and essentially opens doors for that. And so the integrations should be essentially a bridge to talking about our services and how they can make their company more successful. A great place to find Office 365 integrations is at Zap Zapier. Um, you can look for Office 365 right there on the page. You also may want to talk to the vendors that you're working with, your lead exchange members. What types of integrations are available today? And if there, if there isn't an integration, figure out a way to make one. Talk about, so there's web hooks within Zapier that you can create your own custom um, Office 365 integration, but try to identify how can I help my, bus my business partners, my clients through an Office 365 integration. There's lots of examples right there on the page. Um, at the bottom of Zapier, you'll see different uh, Office 365 examples about what you can actually accomplish. And this should actually get, give you some good ideas uh, many of which your clients probably haven't started using yet. And so this, there's a lot of different ways, hundreds of different integrations, and this should make it a lot easier for you to have strategic conversations with your prospects. Now, the best time to actually engage prospects about Office 365 is when they start using it, not two years down the road. It's not as relevant at that point. And so what we've created is a system that identifies companies that have recently switched to Office 365 based off of their DNS records. To access these lists, you can go to ensable.com slash list. And then out of all of the recent events, you can click on new software and then select Office 365 and in input your email here. From here, you'll get a spreadsheet with contact information, businesses, emails, phone numbers, everything you need to execute on this strategy. So when you're working with this, you need to come up with the strategy on your own. You need to figure out how are you going to weaponize your product to create value for your prospects. And specifically, we're working with Office 365, but can, this can be virtually anything. But because Office 365 is so prevalent, it's a great place to start. So you need to figure out how am I going to automate manual processes internally? How can I create ROI? Once you have that theory in place, you can run some tests, uh, talk to existing clients, maybe do some experimental sales where you essentially talk to companies and ask them if they would be willing to test this with you. Once you have a po positive ROI story, this is so powerful because now you just simply share that with companies and the sharing is the sales process. But you want to make sure that you involve your lead exchange members. So who else is going to be involved? Because you're talking about multiple vendors here, you're talking about multiple products. And so form your lead exchange, figure out who's going to be involved and have the entire group share the story with their prospects as well, and then work together to create a comprehensive solution. And so this is how we're going to leverage Office 365 integrations. Essentially what we're going to do is we're going to figure out how to help businesses by optimizing uh, manual processes through integrations, which ultimately lead to our products. And so how do our products talk to Office 365? That is the cell. 
but we're going to be focusing on companies that recently have recently adopted Office 365, which makes our likelihood of winning opportunities much higher. Thanks, everyone, for joining us today. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to any of our team members. And next time we meet, we'll be talking about how to leverage employee complaints for sales. Have a great weekend, and we'll talk to you soon. Take care.